I am so very excited for today because I am not bringing a regular vlog, but rather it is mail time. Why am I this excited? Because I never get letters, I never, never get packages, I don't buy stuff online, but today I have. And I don't know if you've seen the other vlogs, but I've been talking about a book that I really, really liked that was from the Tahoe Library and I had to return it. My personal copy of Making Movies by Cindy Lumet. I have not finished the book, but I think that I've read enough so that I could do a positive review on the book. So this is a book by Sidney Lumet, who is uh, an Academy Award-winning film director. And he's also directed incredible films such as 12 Angry Men and Network and so many others. He's worked with really bright stars and after reading a little bit of his book, I kind of want to get more into watching the rest of his films that I haven't seen. Sidney talks about the different experiences that he has in uh, movie making and this book is divided in several chapters such as um, the director, the script, um, style, actors, camera and he will recount some some anecdotes that he's lived and gone through and what has worked better for him uh, within the Hollywood industry. We can't forget that he's talking about a specific period in time uh, when he was directed in the in the 70s, 80s and 90s. So yes, I am really excited to keep reading, to finish it and I, I'm like maybe 90% sure that I won't change my mind about how good this book is. And yeah, really excited to read it. But movie books are not everything that I'm bringing here today. I've also discovered some books, some of Rich's books that he's lent to me, are really nice, thank you, um, that have changed my mind or changed the way I think about some things. So I think that when a book achieves that, it is very powerful, so I need to share it with you. This is the first book that I want to comment today, it is called what Got You Here Won't Get You There There by Marshall Goldsmith. Uh, he talks about the tricks that he uses on uh, executives and using coaching on them so that they can become better leaders. Uh, one particular feature that this book has, uh, let me see if I find it, is a listing of 20 habits that people do that are not very nice. And we, um, we don't we don't we might not be aware that we're doing it but then if you read the book and then you identify yourself with one of these 20 habits then it gives you a broader vision of why things are working or not working in what you're trying to achieve I would consider it almost to be like a book, book on coaching and personal psychology that any person who works with people or in a team needs to read there you go, so this is What Got You Here Won't Get You There by Marshall Goldsmith. Another book is Getting to Yes. The little I've read has been really good. Like it tells you, it's sort of similar to the other one, it, it sort of like it tells you why people will behave the way they behave or why people will argue and not settle onto an agreement when it's actually really easy. And um, I, felt like I've, um, I felt like I've been identified within the book in the first few pages and that's what has captured me so I think that if you if you work at um, if you need to talk with people or you need to um, figure out how to make a good deal out of anything you should read this. The book comes in different parts it has the first part which is the problem, the method, some questions that you might have after reading the first two parts and then the conclusion so I think it's very easily structured and it, it's a perfect bed night table book to have and let's see what else and then I have another book but I'm not gonna tell you un until a little bit later 